Hi everyone, welcome to today's episode of Simple Science with Danny. This week, because it's now the school holidays, we are going to be doing a special session just for our school holiday program, our Bloom and Blossom. So all about colours and light and flowers. It's so beautiful. So today we're going to be looking at another optical illusion and you may have seen one of my past experiments where we talked about what an optical illusion is. Just to recap, an optical illusion is something that we see with our eyes that tricks our brain a little bit into thinking that it sees something different to what we actually see in reality. The optical illusion we're looking at today is an inverted colours optical illusion. Okay, so coming up next is our first picture. What you'll need to do is stare at the red dot in the centre for a minute. Pretend like you're having a staring contest with it. You can blink a little bit, but try your hardest to focus on that red dot in the middle. After you've looked at this for a minute, I'm going to quickly flick it to our next image. Whoa, pretty cool, right? What did you guys see? What's happening is that when we stare at this picture, all the different colours are stimulating various colour receptors in the back of our eye so that our brain understands what every colour is. But the really cool thing about this is that when we stare at this picture for so long, our colour receptors actually stop responding. This is because they got used to the picture. Who saw different colours start to appear when they looked at the second picture? Basically, your colour receptors were so used to seeing colour that they begin to see it even when there was no colour in the picture. You might have noticed that they also left the first colours out when you looked at the second picture. Let's take a closer look at the second picture without doing the first part of the experiment to see what it really looks like. As you can see, this second picture is actually black and white. The reason we saw the colour that we did in the second picture is because white is a mixture of all the colours. So the colours that we did see in the second picture was white minus the colours that our receptors stopped responding to. That's it for today's episode of Simple Science, guys. I hope you had a great time. Maybe you could even have a go at making your own version of this optical illusion by having a photo and making one coloured with a red dot and then the other black and white. See how you go. Have a great day, guys.